Hello friends. Life is a game of chess. Let's learn some lessons about life from the game chess. Chess has a lot of pieces. Pieces that are important for playing the game of chess. Like in chess there are pawns. In life we are the pawns. The pawn is always controlled by somebody else. So we are controlled by somebody else. That somebody else is not fate. Don't think it is fate. That somebody else is our actions. The actions that I did today, the actions that I did last week, the actions that I did the last month or the last year, in fact even the last decade will influence my present and my future. Today, we are at the first year of the decade 2020 to 2030. The actions that we take today and subsequently in this year, in this decade, will have a huge impact on our future. In a game of chess, the most important piece is the king. In the game of life, we consider ourselves to be the kings of our family, of our business, of our life. But please remember, just like the king can move only one square at a time, men can only do one task at a time. So let's not think of multitasking. Let's focus on the job on hand because what you focus upon gets done. While this is true for men, the queen tells us more about the women. The queen can move straight, she can move diagonally and she protects her king. So the queen, that is the queen of our life, is a multitasker. And yes, friends, let us always thank her for protecting us. She protects us as a mother, as a sister, as a wife and as a daughter, always protecting us. Have you ever wondered what happens to the bishop? The bishop is an advisor. The bishop is a guide. Like in the game of chess, you need a bishop. So in life, you need a coach or an advisor. Because the coach can show you how things can be done by thinking out of the box. By doing something out of ordinary. The bishop does not move straight, but moves diagonally. The castle represents the military, the army. And the castle tells us that sometimes the problems that come in life can be solved by simple, regular, daily actions. By doing what we normally do well. There is that wonderful piece called horse. The horse teaches us that all problems don't have simple solutions. To get real solutions to the problems, you need to do out-of-the-box thinking. You need to overcome obstacles. You need to jump over obstacles like the horse jumps over whatever pieces that come in its way. Please remember, the objective of chess is to checkmate. And a good chess player always begins from the checkmate and then plans his end game, his middle game and his beginning game. So in life, whatever goal we have, Whatever objective we have, let's begin with the end in mind. With the end in mind, we are in a position to plan our end game, our middle game and the beginning of a game. Every step, every action that we need to take. So chess teaches us that the end is important and to reach a goal or an objective, we need to do something. We need to plan and execute our plans. Thank you so much. Please keep returning back for more information, more advice and more gyan about how to be a better and successful entrepreneur. Thank you.